We're doing a roof repair on a residential roof and what we've got here are shingles that are sliding off the roof and the reason that the shingles are sliding is because the shingles were high nailed. This is a problem that we see on a weekly basis. These shingles are only about six or seven years old so the, the roof was installed um, less than 10 years ago and this house is one that we've been to a few times and each time that we come, it's for the same reason, and it's that shingles are sliding. They slide off in, in chunks like this. And the reason that these are sliding is because they were high nailed. So you can see right there, that nail hole, the nails are still on the roof, but this hole right there, this nail should have been placed right there on that glue strip. And the reason that's important, because laminated architectural shingles come in two pieces and they're fused together right in the middle and you can see right there where they're fused together or laminated together that if you don't have a nail that connects with both of these pieces then the shingle will begin to slide and it, it doesn't start to slide right away but this is something that we see a lot and it's really important when you're having your roof replaced that the roofers on the roof know first about proper nail placement where to place the nail and then how low to place the nail. So you have to, this is good placement right here. This is where this nail should have been placed right here, but it should have been placed lower. So shingle spacing and nail placement are very important. You can see the shingle spacing here is okay. It's about eight inches between the shingles. Sometimes we see nails that are right here in this seam and that also creates issues but on this roof, the nails are too high and it's causing shingles to slide. So just be careful when you're having your roof replaced that the nails are being placed in the right spot. This is Billy Guyette with Guyette Roofing.